Hi, my name is Peter Rogine. This is Jazz Guitar USA, and we have something very special for you today. No question about that. E minor. Well, let's examine that a little bit. We're going to start off with an E minor 11 arpeggio, that you're going to make two or three lessons out of this. So mark it on your calendar. We arrive every once a week. So this is the first installment. I'm going to play the arpeggio on the guitar. It starts in the second position. And for this goes out to my friends in Cleveland. I know we have a lot of, of our students out there in Cleveland under the tutelage of an excellent musician and instructor, Professor Joseph Bonsignori. So this goes out to our friends out there in Cleveland. So this is the note E. This is the note G. You'll notice I keep my first finger down while I play on the same string, the G. B, D, F sharp, A, E minor 11. Now for some of you who that's a little struggle for, you learn it by playing two pickings each note. Fourth finger on the D string. Third finger on the G string. Second finger on the B string, first finger on the first string, and then high A, fourth finger. So your first initial practicing could look like this. Down, up, picking on each note. Down, up, down, up, and descending. So we need you to have that down. Two pickings each note. Before you go to the next level, level two, which is strict down up picking, but the same notes, one picking each pitch. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. That's an E minor 11 arpeggio. Let me show you this on a musical staff. So let's take a glance at this. You'll notice you'll see the note E right on the line. Then we go to the third of the chord, the minor third of the chord, G. Then we go to the perfect fifth of the E minor chord, B. Then we're going to the minor seventh interval, D. And dig this now, we're going to the major ninth interval on top, the F sharp. And finally, in this arpeggio, the A is the eleventh, the perfect eleventh. Okay, does that make sense? So we got the root, E, G, the minor third, B, the perfect fifth, D, the minor seventh, F sharp, the ninth, the major ninth interval against E minor seven chord, and the A is the eleventh, the perfect eleventh of an E minor chord. So that's your first arpeggio of today's lesson. Here's one picking each note. bass player. E minor 11 arpeggio. So that's our first part of this lesson and it's going to probably be in a three installment. So work on this. Two pickings each note sustaining into each pitch so it's legato sounding. Don't go for speed. We're really not interested in sweeping. You can sweep but not now. Get this down, very comfortable with your right hand. Each note even in perception. And then one picking each note. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. I hope that helps out. We didn't start improvising with the end. You'll have to trust the process. Get that nice and clear in your hands. Both hands have to be very articulated and working together very clearly. This is Peter Rogine. Any questions, send me, uh, send me an email, progine09 at gmail.com. Until next time, Peter Rogine, keep practicing, master your instrument, master music, then you will be free. Till next time, have some fun.